called out. A well-known priest was just one of the many whose car got stuck in the rising water in Midtown. It happened near Lindell and Vandeventer, and that's where our Robert Townsend is live tonight. Mike and Ann, tonight traffic is moving again along busy Lindell Boulevard, but about seven hours ago, flash flooding stopped Father Paul Sheridan and many other drivers in their tracks. And it was blinding rain. Then I came out because I heard loud thunder. People in Midtown St. Louis say heavy rains kept pouring and flooding busy Lindo Boulevard. And we thought something got hit by lightning because it was like a big old boom. Then I decided not to go on the highway because I thought it'd be safe to go on side streets. Father Paul Sheridan has been a priest at St. Louis University High School for 47 years. He was driving home when his car and several others suddenly became partially submerged in the rising flood water. When the water rose to the sea, I said, I got to get out of here. Father Sheridan, who was all alone, dashed out of his flooded car. And I had the phone up to protect it. Then I tripped and went under the water. He started swimming and we thought he was going to drown. Fortunately, the fearless 77 year old priest didn't drown. As you can see in this photo, he swam to a nearby tree. In a way, I, was, I thought it was humorous. And in a way, I'm going, OK, I accept. St. Louis firefighters rushed in just in the nick of time. Shamaya Billups snapped this dramatic cell phone photo before firefighters helped the soaked priest get inside this McDonald's. I wasn't terribly concerned about safety. I was concerned about how do I protect the car. His waterlogged white Chrysler is now broken down, but from weary onlookers peering from their apartment balconies to plenty of passersby, everyone's just thankful. Uh, the people couldn't be hurt. Kind of. The kind-hearted priest survived. I'm so happy that everybody made it out. Ever been caught in the storm or flood? <laughs> uh, and I can't walk on water. So. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a really cool attitude tonight. You can see back here in this neighborhood, Father shared his car is still out here on this street. Now, as for those McDonald's workers, let me tell you, they gave him a blanket to dry off and some much-needed hot tea and hot chocolate. We're live in Midtown, Robert Townsend, five years side.